PQR upon 2 is an integer, that means out of PQR, at least 1 is even. Maybe 2 are even, maybe all 3 are even, nothing can be said. But at least 1 is definitely even. So with this groundwork, let's look at the statements. PQ plus R is odd. This only tells us that one of them is even, either PQ is even and R is odd, or PQ is odd and R is even. So P could be of course even as well as odd, so statement 1 is not sufficient. Similarly here, the sum is odd, therefore either the first term is even and the second term is odd, or the first term is odd and the second term is even. Again, P could be even as well as odd, so a lone statement 2 also does not work. So now let's combine and see. So for the case where P is even and Q, R are both odd, we see that PQ would be even and R would be odd, even plus odd would be odd. So this statement would be satisfied. And now let's put the same values here. QR, QR would be odd plus P is even. So odd plus even would be odd. So this is also being satisfied for these set of values. So this is suggesting that yes, P is even. Let's try proving that the two statements can be satisfied for some values of P also, for some odd values of P also. If you are unable to do that, that would mean that P cannot be odd and therefore P is definitely even. So the right way in these questions is always try to get a yes as well as no. We know that one of them has to be even. So P is odd, something that we have taken. So we are trying to exploit the second case where PQ is odd, so we must take that Q is odd and the case that R is therefore even. So we are trying to take this combination, P is odd, Q is odd and R is even, a small typo here, this should be E. So in this case C, PQ would be odd plus R, R is even, so odd plus even would be odd. So this statement is working fine for this set of values. And Q into R here would be odd into even, something even. So this is working fine. Plus P, P is odd. So yes, even plus odd would be odd. So this statement is also working fine for this set of values. However, for this set, the answer we are getting is no, P is not even. So yes is also possible. No is also possible on combining. So that means even combining is not working and therefore E is the correct answer choice.